To make your canvas tote bag, you will need to cut two 13 by 14 inch rectangles for the bag, one 6 by 7 inch rectangle for the front pocket, and then two 5 inch times the width of fabric strips to make into the handles for the bag. To begin, place the two strips for the handles along with the pocket piece to one side. Next, turn over one of the bigger rectangle pieces and fold over the top edge of the shorter side twice so that it measures close to half an inch. Pin the entire edge neatly into place and then repeat again with the second rectangle piece. Grab the rectangle cut for the pocket and fold over the shorter edge twice, creating a half inch hem and then pinning securely into place. At the sewing machine, sew a straight line as close as possible to the folded inside edge on all three pieces. Snip each of the joining threads and then place these pieces to one side. Next, grab one of the strips for the bag's handles and fold it in half lengthways and right sides facing. Pin the raw edges together along the whole length of the strip and then sew a generous quarter inch seam from one end to the other. To turn the strap through to the right side, secure a pin to the inside seam allowance and then gently push, gather and pull the pin along the inside of the strap. Once the pin reaches to the other side, gently pull the entirety of the strap inside out and then remove the pin. Then carefully press the strap flat with a hot steamy iron. Repeat the same set of steps with the other fabric strip, resulting in two handle straps for your tote bag. Next, lay out one of your bag pieces along with the pocket piece. To centre them together, fold each in half lengthways matching the pocket centre fold and bottom edge with that of the bags. Place a handle strap piece loosely on top so that it just covers the raw edges of the pocket. After forming a handle at the top, ensure the space between the side edges of the bag and the strap measures no more than 2 inches and that the overhang along the bottom edge is no more than 1 inch. Once everything is in place, carefully pin the strap to the bag, ensuring to catch all three pieces together. Then repeat the same set of steps with the second bag piece and remaining bag strap, measuring and pinning them into the same position as the front bag piece. Starting from the bottom edge of the bag, sew up one side of the strap as close to the outside folded edge as possible. When you reach the top edge of the bag, keep the needle down in the fabric. Lift your presser foot and turn the bag around to the next edge. Sew along this top edge, turn the bag around once more and sew down the next edge, catching and sewing through the raw edge of the pocket as well. Then repeat three more times to secure the bag straps into place. With a rotary blade and ruler, carefully trim the small excess pieces of the straps from the bottom edges of the bag pieces. Place one bag side evenly onto the other, right sides facing. Match the bag straps together at the top and bottom and then generously pin the outside edges into place. Stitch the edge together beginning and ending with a back stitch and continuing with a half inch seam allowance down each side. Finish the inside raw edges with an overlocker or a zigzag stitch on your sewing machine. Gently turn the bag inside out and it's now ready to use.